Well, the deadly floods we had here in October, still a vivid memory, fast, powerful waters, easy to underestimate. This being Flood Safety Awareness Week, first responders put on quite a demonstration today on Lady Bird Lake, and the guest of honor, just glad to be around. On Saturday, responders showed how they pull off daring rescues by land. We call it a throw bag. Boat and helicopter. Imagine doing this in the dark, under enormous stress and time pressures. It's daunting from water level and tough from the sky. These rescuers practice wenching down into the swirling darkness. They may not know what they'll find. Austin Travis County EMS Captain Jim Martin knows firsthand he was trapped in his personal Jeep last October. Raging floodwaters all around him, he waited in the dark. And I kept telling myself that if I just hung on a little bit longer, the sun would come up and I'd get an idea of where I was and what my situation was. I knew I was up against a tree because I could see the silhouette of it. But soon, waiting was no longer an option. And then the water started coming up. And when it got to just about the top of the window to where water was coming in, I had to decide to get into the tree. Or I had to decide to do something. He clung to that tree, keeping the faith his buddies would find Rescue is just above trees. At last, a chopper appeared, plucking him to safety. Watching today's demonstrations by the brave and true, Jim knows every situation is different. You must remain cool and assess the jam you're in. It's okay to be scared, but the important thing is not to panic. Try to think of what you're gonna do. If this happens, this is what I'm gonna to try to do, or if that happens, this is what I'm gonna to try to do. So the key is not to panic. This help is on the way, they're coming. Well, the smartest thing you can do is avoid low water crossings. They are deceptive and can be deadly. KXAN has been looking into rescue workers' response back on Halloween. On our website earlier this week, investigator Robert Maxwell explored communication breakdowns, and rescue boats that were not used the night of the big flood. You can check out that and his previous reports going back months right on KXAN.com. Just click on the Investigations tab.